science project. So when you hear this, I'm going to have a hypothesis of drinks that have sugar are more harmful to teeth and eggs and things like water without sugar are not harmful. So this is what we're going to do. Put, we'll put these drinks in there, the water, the Fanta orange, the Coca-Cola, the orange juice, and the cranberry juice, I think it is. So we're going to pour them in, we'll go put eggs in here. Then we're going to pour them in. In two days, we'll take the eggs out and we'll put it in our science fair project. So the question is, is if the eggs are going to be stained or if they're going to be clean. We're using eggs because their shells are like teeth. I'm going to do a prediction in what I think is going to be the most and least stained. I think this will be the most stained, second most stained, third most stained, fourth most stained, not stained. <laughs> so I'm going to put these eggs in here and then put the liquids in. We'll see if they crack or if they don't. And I have a good idea that probably won't crack. So my favorite drink that we're basically going to be using is probably the only answer is just going to be Fanta Orange. We'll start off by pouring this cranberry juice. Open this up. Oh, you can really hear that. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but here, you can really hear it. It's bubbling so much. And I think I better test this. It's so yummy. I like it a little bit if it was colder because it's a little hot. I felt it, it was cold, but it was hot. Water. Okay, so we're going to let this sit here for two days because this is done. And then two days, we're going to check on it. And if it's already and it has its cavity or its dirtiness, whatever, then we will use it in our science experiment at school. Let's brush our teeth in um, two days, I think. So let's brush our teeth in two days. Okay, eggs? Because you'll be staying a lot. Two days later. Hi, guys. This is Day two of our science experiment of the eggs and how they get stained. So today, we're taking them out. So, we'll start off with the one from the water. 
so this one isn't didn't change at all. All that it is is wet. And you see like little things, but most of it is just wet. So that's all. So that was our first day. Let's put that back in. This one is going to look weird. That's all that I can think. An orange, a, oh wow. That's stain. Oh, okay, no, I don't want to paint orange one. Get away. So if you see here, this has orange. Oh, and it smells very weird. Wait, let me smell the difference. So now we're ready for our third. Oh, wow, well, this one looks... This one... Don't... This one... Kind of looks like chocolate. See? Up close. Chocolate, a little bit. Not that much, but it looks like a chocolate a little bit. It's very little. That smells the same too. That's much better. So this way, probably the same. Besides it, I dropped it. Besides that, now it's all cracked. Wait, let's put that one aside. the pineapple and this like the, um, the orange juice I meant to say this one is very very bubbly and smells very weird but don't want to smell that so it doesn't look that much as stained as the other one do but the one thing that I don't want to do is smell that anymore. You guys wouldn't want to smell that. It smells very bad. Now we're up to our last one. Okay. See what happened to this cranberry juice. What the... This one feels like it's bubbling. You can feel it popping. Okay, I'm going to put this one down because it feels very, very, very weird. And I hate that. It's, it's very, very weird. So now I'm going to put these jars in order. What I think is the like most stained and most of that stuff. What's the most navy, like clean? As always, it's always going to start off as water. Now it's going to be orange juice. Now it's going to be the cranberry juice. Gonna be the Coca Cola. And last but not least, the Fanta Orange. As the most surprise, probably how the cranberry juice had like made it pop so much and the and this orange juice was so bubbly and it smelled so bad i don't know if i have one thing to throw away probably be that egg so in two more days we'll go check if it's like 
maybe more stained, maybe the shell came off, because this time, nothing happened. This is the egg in the water. And that's egg in the water. That's Tars Jackie on to say. You, that's a gross cranberry juice egg. Wow, that's an orange Fanta orange. Coca Coca. Since this is already cracked, we're going to see if anything, like if it got through or anything happened inside. See if I remember how to open this. So it doesn't look like it, it is in here that much. And I'm almost done. But it did a little stick. So it did get in the shell. But I don't see anything in here. Nope, not in two days. It didn't get inside. We've decided to actually wait six days. So, as you can see, the egg in the water, that shell, isn't really that broken. Like, it doesn't come off from that much sugar, and it's like normal eggs. It's like hard boiling it for like six days. So this is the Fanta orange egg. The shell didn't really come off, even though that there's more sugar than Coca-Cola has. So this is the cranberry juice egg. The shell came off a lot, it's very gross. This is the orange juice egg. As you can see, it is a disaster. The shell is off of it. And it's just a disaster. Ew. So here's what I learned. Are you ready for the space? Alright. Oh hello, I didn't see you there. I was just about to go to outer space. So, I was just about to go in the space shuttle, but I knew I would have to stay out here before I went on space to tell you um, what I learned. So, one thing that I learned is that the orange juice really was worse. So, the only shells that were broken were the orange juice and the cranberry juice. But if you still saw the Coca-Cola, it would be the Coca-Cola too. I would not want my teeth to look like those eggs in the jar, except for the water. Make sure to subscribe, leave a like, and leave a comment on what you think we should do the next time.